What's up guys, Boyle96 HD here, we are back with episode 11 of Underrated Informed. I know how much you enjoy these, so uh, if you do enjoy don't forget to smash the like button. Let's see if we can do 150 likes or more. Yesterday's video was an inform and a pack, a live pack opening. Let's, if you want to see who I go and got, check my channel or I'll leave an annotation on the screen. But anyway, the inform today we're doing is Kenwin Jones, Trinidad Tobago, Stoke, Striker. Uh, 79 pace, 78 shot or 76 shot, I think that is currently seen on Sony Vegas. Uh, 76 dribbling and 88 heading is obviously what you're going to be his main asset. 6 foot 2, 24,000 coins is what I bought him for, but he's going for about 17 as we speak on the PlayStation. And uh, yeah, well, so I think he's worth that 17,000 coins, so that is why I have him in. I've played four games with him and I've got nine goals, but including playing against friends, it's about 15 games or 15 goals in about seven games, I'd say, or something like that. But we've gone through his in-game stats. I'll tell you what I like about him and I'll tell you what I do dislike about him. But the main ones that you're going to like about him is going to be his 86 finish and his 89 he heading accuracy. 86 penalties and 94 shot power. That is really, really good in a big man, a big striker like this man. Along with good volleys there, he's fantastic strength. I think it's 94, as you'll see. The one thing I don't like about him is low attacking work rate, medium defensive work rate. I'll talk about more about that in a minute. Three-star skills, three-star weak foot, which is not bad at all. Um... As I said, 94 strength, big, big plus in that guy, along with 80 acceleration, 80 agility, and 81 sprint speed for a big man of, this, uh, of his height, and 84 jumping, which really does go well with his heading. So we've gone to a few clips now, and uh, yeah, I'll tell you, talk about more of what I like about him. So into the goals, we, the best thing i found about this guy has to be his finishing and his... Uh, his finishing from shooting, anyway, is just really, really clinical. He won the most clinical strikers I played with for underrated in form, so you're going to see that throughout the clips. He really picks up the ball, takes it past defenders, and just the keeper has no chance, absolutely no chance at all. He just really breaks the net, and you're going to see that in every clip. He just really is unstoppable to push off the ball with 94 strength. And once he gets in around that 20 yard area in the box, he is not going to miss. He has decent dribbling for a big man too, which means he can maneuver around. And uh, yeah, you're going to see that in the clips. And I think it really does highlight what is best about him. That low attacking worker is annoying as fuck because he never gets in the place you want him to be for headers. And you're going to see that also throughout the clips. I didn't get that many headers. I think I got one. That's, and it wasn't easy enough header to score. Like, But when you're there and you're out one of, the wing, one of your wingers, you're there crossing in waiting for Jones. He's not there. He's either beside you or he's fucking in the halfway line. The most annoying thing about it medium attack and work rates or low attack and work rate and the medium defensive so it's really it doesn't help you at all it's work rates it's one of the worst if not the worst possible and uh, that is definitely the only thing i don't like about him but when he does get the chance to head i'll tell you now he is fantastic for me i think if you were going to buy this guy play him center forward simply for the fact that his heading is simply unbelievable like not a lot of strikers can play against it or not a lot of defenders can defend against it you're going to see he score he gets a few assists in this a great header down he's really good if you have a small striker fast striker with him and just head it down jones can head it down and on to the uh we're going on to it the next player as you're going to see example with this clip there we go jones headed on down to one of my players and he just runs and scores and that's what he's really good for i know you'd want him to be attacking the ball as header wise but if he can do that and if he can get you assists i think he's going to be a good cf you but I, I definitely buy this guy for seventy thousand coins as an underrated in form guaranteed yeah he's not going to be my best one i've done but he is up there he's i think he's really worth the coins for what you're paying did attack and work rates and that do let you down but otherwise a fantastic player who's going to finish for you who's going to score goals and can head the ball when in the right position as i said i'd play mcf if i was you but that is obviously just my personal preference and anyway, i hope you did enjoy this video this is episode 11 of underrated informs if you do please do hit the like button don't forget to subscribe or share the video around even and uh, follow me on twitter at boil 96 hd we'll leave the link in the description uh, yeah thank you very much for watching don't forget to hit the like button cheers and as always have a fantastic day Bye bye